today we are going to do candy corn catapults. Inside of here you will find your instructions. You're going to have a plastic spoon, a candy corn bag. Don't eat these yet. You gotta do the experiment first. You're gonna have 12 craft sticks and one, two, three rubber bands. All right, so first we're gonna take 11 of our craft sticks here. We're going to stack them all up together. And then we're going to take a rubber band and we're going to wrap this around as many times as we need to make sure it's good and secure. I think I'm going to do mine four times here. All right, and now we're going to take one of these and we're going to put it in between the bottom two ones of these. And we're going to slide it a little bit in. This is not only going to be where our spoon attaches, but it also will cause, give stability so that when we push down on the spoon, it won't want to flip up this way because we have the stability here. So once you have this in here, I'd say about a third of the way through, come to this other end. And we'll lock it in by putting the other set of rubber bands around this end. Two, three, four. All right. Good. So now, on the shorter end of the one that you stick you put through, is where you're going to put your spoon. Time to break out that candy corn. And I'll have to say, on my behalf, you don't have to worry about me eating this. I think candy corn is disgusting. I am in that camp. But if you love them, I'm sorry. They're a wonderful treat for you and you can have all the ones you want. <laughs> all right, we load up the payload into the bucket. We apply the force. Yeah. There you go. That's your candy corn catapult.